So, what is an expert system? In this video, we'll cover the following topic. What is an expert system? The main parts of expert systems. How do expert systems work? How such a system would be created? Then we'll give some examples of their uses. An expert system is a computer system that emulates the decision-making ability of a human expert. Expert systems are designed to solve complex problems by reasoning through bodies of knowledge represented mainly as if-then rules. The typical expert system consists of knowledge base, which is a collection of facts created from information provided by human experts. It is a database designed in a way to allow the storage and retrieval requirements of the expert systems. Next, rules base. It is a set of rules for making deductions from the data this is made up of a series of inference rules represented mainly as if then rules these inference rules which closely follow human reasoning are used by the inference engine to draw conclusions next an inference engine which acts like a search engine that applies inference rules in examining the knowledge base for information that matches the user's query it attempts to derive answers from the knowledge base using a form of reasoning Next, user interface is the system that allows a non-expert user to query or question the expert system and to receive advice. The user interface is designed to be as simple to use as possible. On the other hand, the inference engine may also include abilities for explanation so that it can explain to a user the chain of reasoning used to arrive at a particular conclusion by tracing back over the firing of rules that resulted in the assertion. How do expert systems work? First, the expert system must be fed its knowledge, where human experts contribute their information on a particular subject matter, which is programmed into the system. Next, information on the problem or the situation in hand is presented to the system. Through the user interface, a non-expert user can query or question the expert system by asking a question or by answering questions asked by the expert system. The expert system will take the data it has been given and applying a system of rules where the inference engine uses the query to search the knowledge base and then provides an answer or some advice to the user according to the case.
expert systems examples. Here are some examples of situations where expert systems might be used. Car engine faults diagnosis, medical diagnosis, mineral prospecting, chess games, plant identification, animal identification, tax advice, careers advice and guidance, insurance. Now, let's take a look at the first example where car mechanics often use expert system to diagnose faults with car engine. So here how the system works. First, interactive user screen appears and details of car type are entered. Questions about engine problems are asked and onboard computer connected to expert system. Next, Answers to questions and engine problems are typed in. Then the inference engine searches the knowledge base using rule base, where suggested probabilities of faults are output in the form of a report to the mechanic, as well as on-screen report is displayed. Medical diagnosis is another example of situations where expert systems might be used. The process starts where interactive user screen appears, questions asked by the system, and symptoms and answers are typed in. Next, expert system compares symptoms with those in the knowledge base using inference engine and applying rules base. Matches are found and possible diagnosis and advice are up. Now, if we look at medical diagnosis expert system, how such a system would be created? In such a case, doctors are interviewed for requirements, and data is collected from experts, then knowledge base is designed and created. Next, rule base is designed and created, and inference engine is designed and created as well. Then, input screen is designed and created. Next, output format is designed and created. Then the system is tested against known diagnosis and results are evaluated. Then doctors are interviewed about effectiveness of the new system and how does it match original system requirements. 